guys, and welcome back to Eagle TV. I am Joshua, and this is Emily. Now on to Abigail with breakfast and lunch. Hello, W-M-A-E-S. I think that's it. Anywho, it is great to see you again on another Monday morning. Hopefully it's not bad weather. We'll have our little favorite weather guy tell you about that. Anywho, we're going to start off with breakfast, and we have days here too, so say hi. Hi. <laughs> Um, for uh, the 11th, which is Monday, we are going to have cereal and mixed fruit. For Tuesday, we are going to have mini cinnamon rolls. Uh, for Wednesday, we are going to have pancakes. For Thursday, we are going to have apple cinnamon toast. Friday, we are going to have mini... Wait. Yes, we're having mini donuts. And that is all. Moving on to days with the lunches. Okay, so the lunch, uh, the lunch on Monday is going to be grilled cheese sandwich, with green beans, oranges, a milk variety, or a hamburger. Okay? Now, Tuesday is going to be chicken tenders, broccoli, apple, you know, milk, same old, or cheese, breadsticks. And then, um, Wednesday is, is going to be a egg roll with fried rice, oranges, milk, and a chicken sandwich. Thank you so much to our anchors, and we're handing it right on back. Thank you, Abigail, for listing our breakfast and lunch. Now on to Alex with our school events. It was good, y'all. It's Alex for school events for this week. The only thing we got for this week is on Friday. It's a half day, and that's all we got. See you. Thank you, Alex, for telling us the events. Now on to Taken with Teacher of the Week. Good morning, West Michigan. Today I'm here with... Mrs. Russell. She has won Teacher of the Week, and I want to know, how does that make you feel? And were you expecting it? Um, after six months, I don't know if I was expecting it, but thanks a lot, guys, that it took you six months to vote for me. <laughs> <laughs> it, I can't believe it's already been six months. It feels like this year's been flying, hasn't it? Yes, definitely. It's, it's been quite interesting, and yeah, thank you for your time. Thank you. Good morning, West Michigan. Today, I'm here with Mr. Sherlock, and I want to ask you, Mr. Sherlock, what is your least favorite kind of person? Least favorite kind of person? Well, I'm glad you asked, because I've actually been thinking about this a lot lately, and uh, I'm pretty sure it's Hungarian English teachers. Mm, yeah. What do you think? What do you think, Dave? Personally, I agree. I don't like them. Not at all. Not a single bit. Especially when they start talking and stuff. Oh my yeah, goodness! Oh my. Hey, can you, can you can you can you can you get a little zoom on this? <sighs> it's quite quite frankly, I'm not impressed. I'm never gonna yeah, I don't think I'd forget that either. You can forgive, but never forget. Sure. Thank you. Good morning, West Michigan. I'm Tegan, and today we are here with Emery. And I'm gonna be asking him, what is his least favorite kind of person to be around? People who are annoying for no reason. Anything else? No. Is this like bullies? People that aren't nice? Sure. Anything Anything else? Like people that chew with their mouths open? People that don't like shave? No one really shaves in my grade. Oh yeah, that's right. Y'all, how old are you? 13. Thank you for today. Yeah, sure. What's going on everyone? This week's episode, I'm going to be talking to you guys about getting active. Moving your body for like 15 to 30 minutes a day. Um, don't do anything too crazy, like two hours. If you want to, you can. But just start off in small increments if you're not doing much anyways. Go up to like 15 minutes, 30 minutes. Please be outside. It is so good for you. Um, thank you. That's this week. Thank you, Tegan, and thank you, teacher. Now on to Brayden with the sports segment. Good morning, WMES. I am back with another sports segment, and I am joined by the middle school basketball girls coach. His name is Coach Miles, and I'm going to be asking him about that season. So the first question is, how did you think your team performed from the coach's perspective? I, th I think they did good. They went 10-5. and five. That's pretty good. Is there anything else that you think you could have done differently as a coach? Coach better. Emphasize on that. 
emphasize on that. Explain it more. Like, not get on them as much. All right, that's that's good. And um, are you going to play for the middle school boys team next year? Yes. Are you thinking you're going to be the best on the team? Yes. I like the confidence. And this has been Coach Miles' interview with your favorite sports analyst, Braden McMurray. Thank you. Thank you, Braden. Now on to Luis with his amazing weather segment. <clears throat> hey, 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 y'all. Today, let's talk about some weather. So on Monday, it's going to be a sunny day with a high of 50 and a low of 27. On Tuesday, it's going to be a cloudy day with a high of 59 and a low of 37. And on Wednesday, it's going to be a cloudy and sunny day with a high of 47 and a low of 37. And on Thursday, it's going to be a cloudy and sunny day once again with a high of 54 and a low of 31. And on Friday, we're going to end it off with a cloudy day with a high of 52 and a low of 36. Thanks for sticking with me, and I hope you have a beautiful day. Thank you, Luis, for your amazing weather segment. We have been your anchors, and we hope you have an awesome day and an awesome week forever. Bye-bye.